Mac Brown, and the Texas Longhorns. But it is time now to hand out the championship trophy presented by Dr. Pepper to the national champions. And to do that is ACC Commissioner and BCS Commissioner John Swafford. John, thank you very much. On behalf of the institutions of the 11 conferences that participate in the Bowl Championship Series, let me first of all congratulate both of these teams on tremendous seasons and a great effort tonight. And now on behalf of the American Football Coaches Association, it is my distinct pleasure to present the Coaches Trophy, symbolic of this year's national champions, to Coach Nick Saban and the University of Alabama. Drop it. <laughs> since you've been hoisting that trophy back to 2003, but that's another story with another school. It's been a long time for Alabama, 1992, their last national championship. So talk about what it means for the Alabama faithful. Well, first of all, this is something that is special for the state of Alabama. It's special for the University of Alabama. It's special for our fans and our great supporters. But we have a great team at the University of Alabama, starting with our president, Dr. Robert Witt, Mal Moore, our athletic director, our entire coaching staff and administrative staff, and the great players who bought in and sold out and did a lot of blood, sweat, and tears to get to where we are right now. So a lot of people created this for us, and I can only thank them for the great effort that they made. It means a tremendous amount to all of us in the state of Alabama and at the University of Alabama to win the BCS National Championship. You and I talked about four nights ago, and you said as far as bringing a group of young men together with one single mind, this is as good a group as you have ever seen. Well, they certainly are. They all bought into the things that we needed to do, which was work hard to dominate the competition, be a team, play together as a team, and also have discipline to execute in everything that they did. And the message tonight was, do what we do and be who we are. And I thought we did a good job of that after the first quarter. Well, congratulations. We want to bring in the offensive MVP, who's used to bring in a little hardware. Mark, come on over here for a little while. Congratulations. Mark Ingram, offensive MVP. First of all, the Heisman Trophy, and gotta tell you, you're only the second Heisman Trophy winner who's also won the BCS Championship, so congratulations. Thank you, thank you. What's the sweeter? Man, this championship, we had our eyes set on it since the beginning of the year, and just to do it with the whole team, it's truly a team effort, and uh, I'm just so proud of everybody, because we worked hard for it. You had one of the greatest speeches in Heisman Trophy history. You brought tears to the eyes of so many people, and I know you did that again on the field today. What do you have to say to these fans? I'm just so blessed, and I'm so happy to do this for the entire Alabama family. We've been waiting a long time, and we back. Congratulations. Marcel Darius. Marcel Darius, get over here. Defensive player of the game, ladies and gentlemen. And a big smile on his face as well. Early on in this game, when the offense was having problems going, the defense took control of the game and clearly set the tone for how this game would be played. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we did work hard. <laughs> we always told the offense we had that back. It don't matter what problem we was in. <laughs> I don't know how much that. I just. <laughs> okay, <we're done. laughs> You just so happy. Congratulations, by the way. You look good okay. <laughs> Congratulations to the Alabama Crimson Tide. Right now, let's send it back to Brent Musburger. 